Good morning. Welcome to Phil's Camping Reviews. My name is Phil. Today we're going to talk about power when you're camping. Accessibility to power and some of the options you can use but one in particular you would have noticed in the past guys I've got this little All Powers S600 whatever it's called um, I've owned it for a while now and it is awesome thanks to All Powers for sending this to me as you're aware they did send this to me for free uh, to test and try out and All Powers magnificent company I've owned this for quite some time now I think it's well over a year and guys I use it every day not only when I'm used at camping I use it at home too it's just so handy it's so compact as well and it's for the for the size of it I mean guys you can pick this up literally with your little pinky finger it's that lightweight so extremely portable doesn't take up a lot, a lot of room and it's got a 600 watt okay 600 watt inverter in it that's right 600 watt inverter in this and it's true 600 watts so AC DC cigarette lighter plug little light at the back charges quickly you can get them with a solar panel 100 watt 200 watt right up to 400 watt so absolutely brilliant but what if you want something it's a little bit bigger something a little bit more capacity say so, I know a lot of you now like to take um, air fryers with you when you go out camping etc not just an air fryer also a hair dryer etc so what if you need something that's got a little bit more power well don't worry guys all powers have got you covered there as well with the introduction of a new one here called an S2000 so again thank you all pals for sending this to me they did send this to me for free of charge to see but in saying that guys they know I'm going to be honest with the reviews okay going to be honest with the reviews now I've owned this one for a number of months now so it's not like a normal video it's as soon as they arrive bang i do a video on it straight away what i do now is i'm going to use the products for a while and then i can tell you exactly exactly what i think of it and be honest that's the thing i'm being honest so all powers have got no power whatsoever <laughs> pardon the pun over what i say about this this is what I love about the company guys this is what I love about them it's not like some other companies say oh you've got to say this or you've got to say that you've got to send the video from before and then get pre-approval and all that mate I'm free reign I can say whatever I want and do whatever videos I want with this so All Powers contacted me a few months ago and asked if I'm interested in this one here it's an S2000. I wasn't aware about the S2000, only just been recently released. Now, it's slightly different over a lot of the other ones out there, guys. And it's in the battery chemistry. So they're using a slightly different battery chemistry to what a lot of them out there are using on this particular one, even different to this one. So it's a it's a lithium cell okay it's like a lithium it's not a lipo po4 like these ones are okay they're life po4 cells these ones are your conventional lithium cells now to be honest there are advantages there are disadvantages with that okay now i know just watching the news you only got to watch the news and you you know how dangerous lithium cells can be particularly if you keep it in a hot environment so yeah you just got to be careful but then in saying that a lot of it's to do with the quality as well of the lithium cells so this one's got good quality so I cannot see those issues but in saying that guys don't treat it like you were with this one 
This one here I'll have no problems. Right now, here where I live, we're kind of in the middle of summer and we're having a very, very hot summer. Okay? Extremely hot summer at the moment. So I would not keep that stored inside my camper or stored in my vehicle during summer. Not that one actually, this one I will, sorry, but not this one because of the chemistry, because of the cells in it, all right? Now, the, I'll get to it soon, there are some advantages with that, with that chemistry though, so don't get me wrong, this is not all bad, this is not all bad. There are some advantages, huge advantages over Life PO4 with this one. So there's more advantages than there are disadvantages. But the biggest disadvantage and the biggest thing is it is just be careful, okay? Just don't store them in a hot car in the middle of summer, all right? Now, they'll probably be fine, but they are, it is a lithium cell and they don't like being stored in the heat. And in fact, I think if you go through the specifications and go through the company and check that, even they recommend to keep it in environments below 40 degrees Celsius. All right. Whereas if this one here, generally you won't have any problems because it's got a much safer chemistry technology in it, Life PO4. All right. This one, extra caution. That's the worst thing I could say about this unit. Okay. Apart from that, this thing is brilliant. I've been using this a lot every day for the past three months, three, four months since they sent it to me. Actually, it could have even been six months. And it gets used when I'm camping. And not only that, also it's used at home. I use this a lot at home, okay? My home doesn't have a lot of power points throughout. So I charge me phones off this. I even run me 3D printers off this if there's a storm can look in a, can, if there's likely of a storm anywhere, which there is this time of the year, every afternoon we're likely to get a storm. So I run my 3D printers off this and this will keep them going if the power went out or we got surges I know I won't have any problems with the 3D printer because this will run it for quite some time. So 2000 watt, up to 2000 watt continuously so it will peak a lot higher. But that one's got the 2000 watt capacity inverter where this one here, the little fella, it's got 600 watt. Okay? So Yes, that's the beauty with this. 2,000 watt. Four AC plugs. Cigarette lighter plug. USB-C. Standard USB connections. Input connections for your solar panels. Now, All Powers also sent me an All Powers 200 watt solar panel for me to test. And on average, it gets around about 170 watts. So it matches perfectly with this unit. So if you're out remote and it's a compact portable solar panel, I'll do a video separately just on that one using that with this battery pack, but you can also use that solar panel with this one here. And all, all powers also sent me a 100 watt solar panel with this one here as well. So they're all solar panels so far are awesome. I've been using them for quite a while as well as my other solar panels and I've never had an issue with them. What I like about them is they're extremely lightweight and they're very compact so they're easy to set up as well. They've got the, the arms, the legs on the back to extend out so there's nothing additional you need to add to them and yeah, no, I think they're top, top fun. So let's talk a bit about this one. So let's talk about the advantages. We've talked about the main disadvantage, if you could call it a main. It's probably not really a disadvantage, just be careful where you store it, okay? Keep it cool, right? Keep it under 40 degrees Celsius. That's the only thing. Now, I've noticed quite a few of you YouTubers out there are starting to do videos on these. They've been handing out a few of them. I've not seen one video where they talk about the safety of the chemistry is used in this. So I want to be honest and I want to make sure my followers, I know there's quite a few of you guys that do follow my suggestions. So 
if you're from a really hot climate area and you like to go camping in summer a lot or you want to store this inside a vehicle okay just be careful all right just be careful i would not store that inside a hot car in summer up here in queensland because of the chemistry in it with a life po41 no problems as far as i'm concerned safer technology but there are disadvantages and there are advantages with this now if you're from a cooler climate all right you're laughing guys you're laughing and where i'm talking cooler climates i'm talking really cold climates do you camp somewhere where you get up in the morning and there's ice or something out there you know one of the problems of life po4 is once the um, temperature of that battery drops below five degrees celsius it's suggested not to charge it all right suggests it's not good for the battery you will you can damage the battery with life po4 if you charge and temperatures below five degrees celsius so a lot of some of the manufacturers out there they go to the extent where they put heaters inside the battery pack all right so you don't have that problem okay i've i have encountered that problem in the past there have been times where my life po4 battery inside my vehicle i'm not being able to charge it because the temperature was below five degrees celsius now it's quite rare for that to happen up here in queensland but believe it or not it, it does happen i mean i've camped in places in queensland last year i woke up in the morning and there's icicles hanging off my vehicle and my camper but i was inside the camper here t-shirt and shorts because of my diesel heater <laughs> That's, that's awesome <laughs> can't wait to win her eh? <laughs> cannot wait to win it guys so that does not affect with that problem it does not have that problem so it could be below zero degrees you'll still be able to charge this at full power so there's a huge advantage there over your life po4 batteries also lithium cells uh, much more dense in capacity and size compared to the life po4 batteries so what does that mean guys this is a 2000 watt 2000 watt power supply okay 2000 watt inverter in this it's got 1500 watt energy but i want to show you something Look how light that is guys look how light this is all right it is a lot lighter than the equivalent life po4 it's a lot more compact because of the size of the battery pack the size and the weight it's got more stored energy in it over a life po4 all right so that it's not a lot much bigger than what this fella is okay and yet it's got three times for actually probably four or five times more capacity in this than it does on this one so it's a huge huge advantage with that because i've seen some of these 2000 watt units and they are a beast to pick up and carry around so huge advantage of this so yeah it's got good warranty backed by a reputable company comes with all the accessories you need it's got all the inputs for your solar regulator so honestly guys if you're after an all-in-one unit all powers value for money what as well one of the cheaper ones out there but still got the good quality backed by a company that's been building these for quite some time now it's only just recently they started selling them in australia so you may not have heard them because of that but they've been sold overseas for a long time so check them out i have no problems running my air fryer on this i have no problems running my induction on this 
I have no problems running my huge 3D printer, guys. I've got a huge 3D printer that runs off this, you know, for safety. I use it to charge all my torches. I use it to charge my phones, etc. It's always turned on in the house all the time. Charges quickly. Very fast. Comes with a cigarette lighter charger. You can charge it in the car while you're driving along. It includes all that. Even comes with a cover. There's a really nice cover with four powers written on it. So it's like a bag you can store it in. So it's got fans. So the fans will turn on when you need to. Now mind you, the fans are a little bit noisy. They are a little bit noisy I find. So if you're a light sleeper and you've got this sitting inside your van at night time, but then if you're using this in a cooler climate, the fan's really not going to come on, so it's not going to be a really a problem. But if it's only in, in summer where you'll have the problem. So guys, check it out, all powers. I should have a discount code for you very soon. So there'll be a link down below with a discount code that I'll put in the comments section, in the description section, okay? So as soon as I get that, if it's not there now, don't worry, just come back shortly. By the time you're watching this, it should be already in there. So check out the discount code. So, I mean, compare this to some of the others on the market. Guys, this is a winner, as far as I'm concerned. I think all powers are awesome. They're a great company to deal with. They don't try to control me when I'm doing the videos and that's what I love about them. I can be honest about it, okay? When they told me they were sending me this, the first thing, to be honest, I'm gonna tell you the truth, the first thing I said to them is I'm just concerned about the chemistry. That's all. And I told them straight, I ain't gonna warn people from using it in very hot climate environment. And they seem fine with that. They seem fine, okay? So as long as you're aware where you store this, make sure you don't store it somewhere where it's too hot. Look after it. It'll look after you for many years to come. And if you use it in winter time, mate, this thing's got advantages over your conventional Life PO4 batteries. Now I love the Life PO4. But in really, really cold climates, they can become an issue. Okay, they can become an issue. This one, you won't have that problem. Won't have that problem at all. Charge it anytime. So, till next time, eh? Cheers.